Hi, I'm the blacksmith. And I'm KJ the architect. And we are the Hip Hop Professors. Believe that. And here are our special guests, once again, Paranormal Adam and JD. Cue the intro. Excuse me. Hip Hop History. There's no mystery. Blacksmith affords the crucible. Simplicity. KJ the architect. Led scratch aggressor. When we combine, we are the Hip Hop Professors. Hello folks, welcome back, yes back, to the Hip Hop Professors. This show is Hip Hop Quotables, alright? And again, remember, we're doing old school hip hop, so we're staying within our range, ending at the year 2000. So anything before that is a Hip Hop Quotable, and we're going to go. You said 2000? Oh, you got to change up your list, don't you? Go ahead, fast. Alright, so, let's see, who's going to go first? Don't matter to me. <coughs> Paranormal Adam. All right. Who you got? At number five, I got cannabis. Okay. But make a name for ourselves. The joint went off. That, um, All right. So we're going to do it like this then. Name of the artist and, and the what song. song. And the song. Yeah. With That's our, criteria. Yeah. With our common. Okay. All right. Oh, with, I remember with, that with shit. Eight common up yeah. with his own song. Yeah. Yeah. I remember that shit. Yeah. <coughs> And they had two verses, but that's when he was talking about he uh, he's one man, but he walked with three shadows. And then he was going sick. It was like, ah, uh, damn. But yo, that was, was a hot shit. He was going in. I remember that. That's yeah. the that's the first time I, I heard that. cannabis, even though he did the How High remix first. Right, right, right. Then I got Inspector Deck on Triumph. Triumph. Yeah, Inspector Deck. That to me, going and out of. Alright. Uh, I got you on that. Then I got. Give, give me some of that. Give me a little bit of that. A bomb atomically. Ah, oh, damn. See, we, we had too much of this, so. <laughs> <laughs> damn. Well, I, know I feel you, though. You yeah. know what I mean? I know so you know. But, um, <coughs> Ring. You said 2000. This is this came up a few years ago, but it's. Alright, use it. it. Yeah, go okay. yeah, just use it. Just go for Black it. Thought. Oh, it's gonna be dope. Or Rapid Roots. Eye Movement, if you heard. I just downloaded the joint. that song. Him and, uh, him and him and Pharaoh, Pharaoh Monch. Yeah, he killed, oh. he killed that verse. Oh. I don't think I heard that yet. Oh. All I know, one line he says is, he says, um, he says something like sadomasochist, giving master my ass to kiss. And then he was killing this shit. He was just killing Crazy. it. I don't think I heard that one. I um, didn't hear that yet. That's on um, <coughs> Pharaoh Monch's last album. Um, oh, okay. PSD. Uh, then I got to go with some classics. So, my number two is Nas Live at the Barbecue first. Oh, okay. my God. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. I got you. Okay. Because that, that was like, I like verses that introduce you to um, dudes. And, like, then they follow through with it. it and, and they keep going. Like, it's, that, that wasn't just, like, like a one-hit shot. And then my number one, I think this verse right here, I don't know if there's any verse that from the beginning to the end, the dude did not, he felt the whole page was AZ and Life's a Bitch. Life's a Bitch. Did that verse die. is crazy. You're okay. high. I'll say, I'll say, I'll say you my never know when you're going to go. You never know. I got you on that AZ. That's my nigga. Though. I love AZ that killed that verse. Like, that was for somebody on a, somebody, I guess appearance, the only one on a lyrical dude's classic album. That could be arguably the best, best verse on the album, and that wasn't even his album. Okay. And I'll save my honorables after that. Yeah, okay. So go right back around. So, so, my, yeah, do I, ain't got, I ain't doing all five, but I can come up with five. I know that. All right, what you got? Let me get my paper right here. My boy. My boy. Everybody said I look like back then. Boy, MC Shan. MC Shan. I pioneered this shit. That's oh cool. my shit, god! That's that shit. Actually, I got one quote, but the whole his whole shit was fire. That whole that whole goddamn song was just fire. Yeah. We doing? You want me to say the quotes? Say the quote. Cool. Just say yeah, if you if you want to. It says since you chart, my mind will erase you. Want a piece of that ass so bad I can taste you. Damn! I should tell some bitches that. <laughs> yeah. My wife might cut. Me. She yeah, might cut. Me. We don't get cut. Next one. 
Rakim follow the leader. T G. But go ahead. From the, <laughs> but not, you know that's the shit. I'm, yeah, that's like. But yeah. what thing with Rakim? He got so much. Yeah. You got it's kind of tight to put him down. Mm-hmm. But I like this one because this is when him and Kane was doing that beef, mm-hmm. and they came out of nowhere with. Stop brother, stop bugging the brother. Said dig him, I never dug him, couldn't call him. Leave him, so I drug him. I ain't never heard no shit like that. Oh my god! (laughs) My other one would be Nas. What was oh, what was the name of the song? um, Anyone, pretty yeah, pretty much. When he said I, I snuck a Uzi on the island in my army yeah, jacket lining. Yeah, that was yeah, that's, ain't hard to tell. Yeah, yeah, ain't hard, yeah, hard to tell. Like yeah, selling prevail the mic is contacted. I attract clients. Yeah, tell. It was crazy. Then my boy, my next one would be not not coming as a hard like lyric MC, but I got to give my boy Casanova Rudd. Do the Super James. Lover C. Do the James. That whole song. Yeah. Was that whole song? Everything he spit was fire. Super love of C, and that that what's the what's that for? ugly people? Ugly people. He spit some fire. No, that was, no, that that was marvelous. Oh, that's yeah, marvelous. That's yeah. cash, cash money, money on the yeah. track. Yeah. yeah, that shit was dope too. What's that for? Yeah. One more. You know what? Back to when we were talking about last time. I gotta go, with my boy L, with the breakdown. L O fire. L L this, L L that. As soon as I walk into place, I want to take my gun and shoot you in your motherfucking face. I gotta roll right with my boy. I gotta roll with that. that he got too much shit too. That but dope. that shit right there, that made me respect that, that him. Yo, flames. Now that you say that, that shit fire. That's fire. Now that's that fire. you say that, cause I came unprepared, cause you know this was sprung on me, like outside the front door. <laughs> actually, <laughs> nigga told me about it walking down the bit. steps. Move up a little bit. Move, move a little bit. Well, actually, he told me about him walking down the steps. So this is like, you know, this is, but just piggybacking off you, LL. Hip hop quotable. Um, I'm just gonna go with L's first joint. I need, a, I need a beat. Oh, I need a beat. Yo, I need a beat from beginning to end was a magnificent it's a Malibu song. Beat subject. Everything of he said. Has anybody? I don't mean to cut you, but has, has anybody ever broke down the process of recording the song? Like he that? did it. He broke and I need down. a beat. Yeah. He, he, he broke, broke down, down the down. studio and. <laughs> Everything that oh, was oh, it, that the man. whole song is a quotable. I just was listening to it today before I lost my music. <laughs> I was listening to it today. I need a beat. It was is like arguably one of the greatest songs of all time. Oh yeah, because L was before his time, and just hungry. the things he he said when when he said um, studio abuser. What? This is the perfect place to do in the studio? Oh, my God. He was before his time. So I'm going to go with LL on that. And I'm no, also going to piggyback <clears throat> back on you. And, well, I'm, I'm going to go with Large Professor. I was going to say MC Shan, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to choose Large Professor. Okay. Because Large Professor impressed me with, and I'm, I'm going to give him two songs. I'm going to give him two songs. Because Lost Professor is a producer. Yeah. But when you think of the lyrics he said on looking at the front door, door. Yeah. we fight every that. night, but that's not oh, culture. culture. I reminisce with Bliss of when we was closer to, wake, to be greeted yeah. by an argument again. You act like a 10. <laughs> so immature, I try to concentrate on the cure, but keep looking at the front, front door. door, thinking if I were to evacuate, <clears throat> you'd probably be straight and straight and wouldn't have so much hate. Because you don't understand the pain when I see you smiling. Then when I roll up, you start wilding. Yeah. Oh, yo, the lyrics is hell. That one and just hanging out, hanging out. Yeah, I forgot. I'm going over some rough raps, but kids steal my lyrics like hubcaps and eat them like stacks of flat jacks like rug rap. Hey, I get busy over unknown track while the next kid flaps his lids like parquet. I'm skilled in this field, so slide to the side. I make a crack of pride so I could get some shut eye. While you're having a hard time writing rhymes, you know on my metaphor and dines on my lines. Oh my God! <laughs> did you did you hear it? And the whole and looking dead. at the front door, front yeah, door, front was door that crazy. Was, yeah, that was that shit. So I'm gonna go with two large professors, and I'm gonna hit that that LL cut right there. Then I gotta go with Rock Kim because I'm unprepared. I gotta go with Rock Kim. As the earth gets further and further, further away, planets as small as the balls of clay, I stray into, I stray into the Milky Way, stars out of sight. 
far as the eye can see, not even a satellite. Then you stop, take around and look. As you stare in the darkness, your mouth is shook. <clears throat> oh, my God. Back then, who was talking about that? No one. Planets are small as a balls of clay. No, small no as one. balls of clay. No one. No one. That, that was... That came out in 89. That was ridiculous. That was a ridiculous metaphor for 89. And that was on some soft mode, Jim. Yeah. Yeah, that was the second album. Yeah, yeah that was Sophomore the second album. Sophomore Curse didn't apply. <laughs> yeah, that was the second album. Oh. Sophomore Curse did not apply. Oh, so. so, my fifth and final one, I was kind of, I was kind of tossed up because I love KRS. Because KRS... Keras just got. He got so many. He got so he many got so joints many. that um, I'm just just out of the top because I listened to it earlier today. The beat and the way he just kicked the lyrics, and I'm gonna go with something easy. The style you haven't learned yet. Many have claimed to attain levels of rhyming, but when I listen to him, I see <coughs> they're only lying, trying. After some years, if you ain't got it. Lay it down, put it down, try to try to find a way to stop it, change it, rearrange it, be a producer. Don't ever touch my style because you'll always be the loser. loser. Laughed at, smirked on, you don't belong. The styles I can't go on and on and on and on. But let's get specific. This game is for the lifted, poetic the game this game is for the gifted, poetically uplifted. <coughs> KRS, nope, not ready to say my name yet. Crazy. Oh. Crazy. And that's on this. Mm. <laughs> so, those are my five. Well, well, here we go. I know Pod K in here somewhere. <laughs> stop, stop. Pod K, don't say nothing bad about Pod K. You know, you know he's in there. She's saying nothing right, bad about so Ms. Johnson. I gotta, I gotta <coughs> rock him as my first. Of course. Yeah, we're always going to have it. Oh, Move man. the crowd. <laughs> oh. Listen. Move the crowd. As a felon just brought it Let's just, just, let's, 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 just, just from the onset of the song. Standing by the speaker, suddenly I had this fever. Was it me or either summer madness? But I just can't stand around. Because I get closer and the closer I get, the better it sounds. My mind starts to activate. Rhymes collaborate. Cause when I heard the beat, I just had to make something from the top of my head. So I fell into the groove and the wax, and I said, "How can I move the crowd?" We can't. We can't do the whole song. Right, we yeah, can't listen, do the whole song. Listen, we can do that whole song. That song. That song. Think about. Think about that. That song. The imagery. You felt like you were on the record as he's speaking it, like you're there with him and you're witnessing every marvel that he's witnessing. That made me appreciate records, DJs, the whole process mm -hmm. so much. That was the one. That's that crazy, was the though. one. That song was so crazy. It made you feel like yes. you wrote that. Yes. Like Yo, when you that, say it, yes. That was, listen, <laughs> that was my That's favorite a, song on the album. Mine too. Mine too. Mine too. Mine too. That, no, I know you got soul. I didn't soul particularly care for that. Was that, that, that will turn right? me. That will turn me. Yeah. Nah, I didn't that, particularly. That was our favorite song. My melody was mine. That was good. That was mine. All right, so. How many bars my melody? Two many two hundred bars. Yeah. Let me tell you, I know you got souls. Because I was gonna use that. I was gonna use that. I put Crazy. seven MCs, put them in a line. All right. So let, let me get back. All right. My next one. The raw. Okay. So a little bit of trivia about raw. King. By King. Oh no. Let me tell you about raw. Rap. Let me tell you about raw. Hold up. You raw. can't tell me nothing oh, about King. No. I know oh, everything about King. Oh, you might not know me, this. Me and Tony go Wait, back. Wait. You might not know this. Move up here, little cool. So you witness. Yeah. Raw was originally just supposed to be a freestyle. Yeah, with Big Daddy Kane and Coogee Rap. And Rap. I, I had it in the car. Okay, so you know, it was not originally supposed to be a single. It was just yeah. supposed to be a freestyle. Yeah. No. Okay. And we listened to that the other day. Didn't yes. And and Coogee Rap. Yes, he did. Killed it. First of all, this little note is like a formula. The antidote. But copycat, as I quote, they want a deep throat. Lyrics that I wrote placed upon a beat so neat. Come on, son, do I gotta say more than that? The way he crafted that fucking verse, Cool G is the best. You knew right then and there that Cool G was the best MC they had on Cold Chilling. 
you knew right there. Automatically. And this was Kane's. Never denied it. This was going to be Kane's song. You knew that this was Cool G's name. Cool G. He had, he, it was so dope. Cool G had to come off of that record. He had to make it his record. Mm -hmm. But another thing about your boy Cool G. Yes, go. Another thing about your boy Cool G. Yes. That now, <coughs> I didn't hear this from Molly, Molly mouth, but back some years back when I was with the Funky Natives, okay. they never wanted me down this show. The Funky Natives. They don't even talk about the Funky Natives when they talk about Connecticut Hip Hop. <laughs> anyway, what I found out back then, remember when we, me and Damon Akbar, we were supposed to get the, the we were supposed to sign a contract with Coach Ellen, but remember I told you I went and got stupid actors. This is good history, folks. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Anyway, back then, Found out that G Rap made poison in a bathroom. In a bathroom. Yeah, yeah. One, I knew that. One take. One take. Yep. <clears throat> yep. Did poison. Walked in, one did take. it from beginning to end. Yep. Who does that? That's hip hop history right there. Look at and that. And poison is like. Yeah. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. All right. Poison is ridiculous. Well, let me get back in the way. Okay. This one, it took me a while to really. Because I kept listening to the song over and over again. Pause, okay. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm going to get to that. No. Ja Rule. Nope. That's insulting. You don't like Jeffrey? No. What? <laughs> He's a kid fucking rocks. That's what he can do. I like Ja, man. Right. I like Jeffrey. Anyway. Ja. I like Jeffrey. <coughs> Whack, you, motherfucker. You, you anyway. I ain't like Jeffrey. Brand Nubian, she... right? Which one? Don't, don't just, just one person. Or... No, no. Just Who one person. Who can get busy? Just one person. There's one Grand first Pooba. on. Yes. Step to the rear. No, no, no. no. To rear, Step two is on arrival. Yeah. Raised in the ghetto singing songs oh, called survival. survival. Run around town giving all the girls pooba snacks. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Pooba snacks. No. Come on, son. You know what? We Try got. Trying to steal a style. You want just get to Cardi. Come on. That verse. Yo, Pooba. Remember, Pooba was the hottest. Pooba was the hottest yes. thing on the planet for like two they summers. Yes. They shut Pooba down, though. But yo, Pooh you know what? Tonight. No one wanted Pooh yeah, Ellis was. versus was. what? Wait, wait, let me let me, let me finish yeah, my list. Let me finish yeah, my yeah, list. Go ahead. Go ahead. I don't want to yeah, cause we gotta get back into it. Cause I, there's more. There's more. Everybody got, you know, those their uh honorable mentions. Okay. This one's controversial. Hey you guys know it's not Boss K. <laughs> Jeffrey yeah. Atkins. Jeffrey Atkins. Jeffrey Atkins. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, like that. Anyway. I like I always like DPMD. Yeah. No doubt. But they did something I'm that was so... I, I, know, I know, I know, I <laughs> know. Well, he's not the person I picked. Oh, not Red yeah, right. No. Oh. Yeah, I, I, chose, I chose PMD. And there was a verse that he did. This this one particular song was so different from all the songs they had ever done. Up at this point, this is on the second album, I believe. That song, mm. Rap is Out of Control. Rap is, no, that was... No, that's, that's the third. Third album. Third okay, third album. Rap is Out of Control was crazy. It was so... Was really? It was than every never song. Never heard it. Wasn't I, it I didn't heard. like it when I, I first heard, heard it. Because it wasn't... It, it wasn't was their normal thing, right? Because it came on the, it came on the maxi scene. Yes. So I'm like, what the fuck is this? Yes. But then once you heard... Yes. ...what this Dude, nigga was saying... Wait, wait. I gotta, I gotta quote a little bit of this. Quote Because you never heard it. Oh, my God. All right. Let's talk All right. So, that G-Man verse was dope, but... PMD comes in. Can I, cause before before go. we go there, because yes. I'm going to forget all about Grand yes, Pooba, yes, yes. but we said Grand Pooba. Yes. One of Grand Pooba's Ellis verses, like I know what you got. Yes, yes, yes. But one of Grand Pooba's Ellis shits was, I heard the Beatles swinging odors like his yeah, name was, was David, David Ruffin. Ruffin. Yes. Yeah. Crazy. They, that was the Ellis yeah. line ever. Yes, go ahead. crazy. Yeah. I concur, yes. All right, so his verse, he said, damn, shit's dope. He said, Came from the underground, where universal beat that is the must. Should I smack crab in CZ? Too late, they got crushed. Be a pop rap singer, R and B swinger, faggot who jumped the gate and now he gets the finger. In other words, it's absurd to try to get with the brother from Brooklyn, Long Island, nicknamed Quick Mix. I'm too smooth, and yes, I groove one with slam track. Bex in my right hand, left hand on Bozak. I move on your posse. First reaction is, oh shit. Just do that, brother. Hell no. Why? He's, He's too, too quick. quick. Throw down one nine hundred five five e shit. shit. I pack a twelve mark mill and still I still kick. What ass like a jock? I six three in stocky. Last name not Balboa. <laughs> so motherfuck Rocky. <laughs> Man, I was like, oh shit. Nah. I never heard it. Nah, I never heard, heard it. He was going in. I never he was heard going it. Yeah, yeah, in yeah. on that fucking. You oh got my it? God. He was going. Rapid I, got, I, I got over there. I it's never. Like, it's I crates. never it's heard it. Rapid out of control. That is one of the yeah. dopest shit. First of all, that G Man shit was yeah. for that. That shit was dope. <laughs> Eric Sermon came in and was yeah. killing it. G Man, do I have the power <laughs> like, like He Man? Smack a whack of C Z. Open like a pecan dam. That shit was dope as 
but it was so different. Yo, but everything they'd ever done. I've like never heard it. I need so to hear that. It you was just fire. fire. It, was fire. Fo- it was the fire. vocals go. Yo, but you know, you know, we're yeah, forgetting like, about. You know, we're we'll forgetting about since we give and do honorable mentions. All right. Well, let me do my last. Mr. Funky. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Good. Oh, good, good. Pasque. No, no. Jeffrey Atkins. Jeffrey Atkins. Onyx. There's only one song that I'm gonna mention because Sticky, Sticky Fingers. Yeah, yeah. His verse. <coughs> and throw those. Throw the gun. Throw your guns. Oh yeah. Listen, yeah. listen. I can listen. respect that one. Yeah. Definitely. Listen, listen. <laughs> you had a bad. Okay. I'm sorry. Go ahead. I ain't gonna even get on your shit. It's... Start that shit. Ah. Uh, oh, hate your fucking you guts. It, I and I hope that, that you got Sticky Fingers. Yeah. Name in my life is a lot. See, I'm having a bad day, so stay out of my way. And we're the pistol packing people, so you better obey. Just in the nick of time, I can make the perfect crime. Rip my heart out my chest, put it right into a rhyme. I don't feel pain, cause it's all in the mind. And with mine is mine, and yours is mine. Don't fucking blink or I'ma rob your ass blind. Onyx is wrecking shit, I got the tech nine. So what the bubble clock, boy, ba 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 ba. Just yeah, one line going after sick. the next. Sticky, yeah. sticky. He, he was going crucial. Say, but, but, hold on. Crucial. Gotta, I gotta concur. But how about his line on the words? Nah, he, him and meth went sick. Him and meth went retarded. But like, again, like I said. First things first, man. You the introduction. Do Who's that? You, you, like, yo, you got this, my bad? Yeah. This nigga dope. Yeah. Yo, sticky. And yeah. we already knew that he was good. He was the <coughs> he one was the a stand-up. group. Yeah, he was a stand-up. Yeah, yeah. Just yeah. like Buster was with Lord of, you know, of um, Leader of the New School. Yeah. He was the standout. You knew yeah. he was going to blow. It's crazy because they put, they, they, they structured all that for Charlie Brown. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they he did. Yeah, they did. Yeah, he mad. Yeah, he was mad. He was structured it for That's Charlie Brown. That's why he was supposed to be the star. Yeah, yes. he was, yeah Charlie Charlie was Charlie Brown put yeah. it together and he, he wanted to be the star. Right. You remember all that whimsical shit, motherfucking, yeah. ah, ah, smacking motherfuckers yeah. in the mind of it. That bullshit. No. Buster Rhymes. Buster was like, yeah. Buster Rhymes. And then they tried to replace him with that corny ass Milo motherfucker. I see you, motherfucker. Milo, he was whack. You were whack, sir. Whack, sir. Yo, t- how's you. that verse go on the worst? I got, I had the shit. I gotta hear it. Like right now, first thing, you know, we, I'm not right. Who's that? It's John John. Sticky, you got my back. I got your back, cuz on. I got the mat, cuz on. And when them niggas buzz. Dark shit, we bust back, cause uh, cause yeah. it's a prayer. The video is crazy. I, I, I want you to tell shield me. Shield Nowadays, shit. rappers dying over music. Dead I want on you to tell me. And no one can tell street. me this. I want you to tell me one verse of Sticky Spit that wasn't dope. Forget about Fred nah, Rose that and Sun Sea. He's that type of he's, artist. Right, he's that he's artist. He's that artist that always like Red hits. Man. Like Red Man, Man yeah. is always consistent. Red Man is I have, I have, always I have, consistent. I have Red Man. And the only reason why I couldn't put him on, on any of my <laughs> lists is because he's too much. It's too much. Yeah. I didn't yeah, know what to pick. Yeah, Let yeah, me yeah, ask you, as far as like kids do that do features, yes. yeah. soloists that do features together, yes. who's better, Red and Meth or who else? Cause red and meth just feed off each other yeah, like yeah, no yeah. other. Yeah, I, but, I can't say there's another co- everybody me, collaboration better than that. No, a but collaboration. But did you? That's not a group. Like yeah, that's not they, a group. They just okay. organically. Yeah. Okay, yeah. but on the worst, the ca- collab that was between sick. Sticky nah, that and was Red sick. was. Nah, that was I mean, oh, meth. Nah, that was crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, that was so crazy. I love Red and Meth together. Cause uh, you, uh, you was yeah, you Rottweiler, Rottweiler. I was cracking up that fucking serial killer song. I played it yesterday. Which one? Serial killer. Yo, some songs. Yo, that shit was fucking hilarious. On some real shit, though, yeah. on at least 30% of the songs they do, though, Red be killing. Yes! Like, Red. a serial killer. Yes, he killed him. Yo, it's that nigga said, yo, I take... Happy birthday. Oh, 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 He shot the room. Yeah, yeah. Is that his I don't know the song. So the nigga came, in, oh the nigga came in the room, they was like, Happy I'll birthday! Go, it was, was a surprise party. Yeah, he was trying to popping again. He started popping. He was trying to kill somebody else. Yeah. But he hit the wrong group. He hit like somebody's yeah, birthday, like birthday party. party and then he said, they were singing happy birthday. He'd already let off. Already let and he was like, oh, oh, oh. Hilarious. Serial killer. Serial killer. Is that the video the same song? When they do, um, when he take, he said, um, I take um, nuts and bolts out of, uh, fruit out of fear. Yes. Yeah, that's yes. the same yes. one. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, that's I'm not saying nuts and bolts fear as well. That was wild. That particular Red is. I can play a hundred times. Red is crazy. And I'll get sick of it because it's yeah. so fucking dope. Yeah, Red. Some Red, Red wins. You know, yeah. you know yeah. what Red else touched. was a dope song now that we talking yeah. about? Red people is who Red did is collabs. Touched. Red is touched. Um, 
and we talking about collabos. Uh, uh, the shit with um, Dr. Dre and Ice Cube. Natural Born Killers? Natural Born Killers. Yeah. Uh, all right. They yeah. went sick. Bling, 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 listen to the ill shit that I bring, bring. You, but you don't really know how I feel about Cube. Yo. Yeah, that's, and, and, and the West. That's my dude. Cube, that's my dude. Fuck West Coast. Cube just nasty. He is. See, Yo, yeah. this shit. So see, am I illa? Anything that he's going to be on, he's going to destroy it. Because that, 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 that serial yeah, killer? That whole that, song. That song that's right right killers? Yeah, I can see that. You know, you know what song that I, I was listening to? And I know it's a more updated song. But you remember that shit that they Jeffrey did? Jeffrey Atkins and who else? A <laughs> <laughs> hundred guns going to New York with Fat Joe and Jeffrey Atkins? No. That fucking, um, <laughs> that, um, older shit that, uh, Kanye oh, and oh, Jay Kanye did. did. No, the fucking remix with Buster and, uh, DMX. Oh, I hear that. Oh, I hear that. Oh, my God. You, this is how dope it was. You're going to forget that somebody else did it before they did it. Really? Oh, my yeah, God. Yeah, I hear that one. Them niggas I didn't know they had a remix. This is, this is after Jay, after... DMX just got out of jail. DMX like the illest around the way rapper ever. But yeah. him featuring on, on people's shit. Yeah, he be killing. He be he kill it. Yo, he killed that. This that is the beat. That's the beat too. He can kill touch it. Touch it. Oh yeah. Touch it. The monster X is the beast. Yeah. Fucking with busts every man. He was the least lyrical on five, four, three, two, one. I agree. He killed it though. But he killed it. He killed it though. Yo, yo, but cannabis, as far as that, I'm the illest uh, nigga alive. Watch me prove it. I snatch the crown with the head. Still attached to it. Cannabis is the type to fight for Mike. Beating niggas, niggas to death, death and beating dead death niggas to life. life. That was lyrical. It's crazy. Look at me long enough. I start to, to read your thoughts. I start right? to read your thoughts like I had a phone number. Like how many rhymes <laughs> I got? I could go for more millennia than Mazda got on a car lot. Yeah. Let's do some more. Um. Did you do your one? All five? Yeah. Yeah. I'm good. I'm ready for the. I want to hear other people's um. Yeah, their, their honorable, mentions. Honorable, mentions. Yeah, yeah, honorable mention. It's an honorable mention. Yeah, and the honorable mention. Yeah, and I want to some honorable mention. Okay, I don't have none. I got couple. I got. Like, I got eight. honorable I mentions. I really do my homework. All right, like, I'm you, not, know, you know how Shaq do. Up you, know how, you know how Shaq do. Shaq in the food. Shaq right? food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Not you Shaq know who don't? Not Shaq food. Could I? Could I ask y'all something? Yeah. Just out of um, real quick. Out of few snickers, the, the little Jamaican nigga who you The little dark skin dude. Chip. Nah, he's Chip Fool. Chip Fool. Chip Fool nasty. Okay. Yeah. Like I couldn't think of not the name. Chip Fool. Chip. Because I, I just was listening yeah. to Rain Air Live. Rain Air Live. Remember that shit? Yeah, yeah. yeah. The song will break you down. Chip Fool was going sick. Ah, you want to feel all the room. Chip Fool. I can't see them things. I miss them a dude. Who you got? I kind of did like how Shaq be doing Shaq and the Fool and how he be picking on, um, what's my man's name? The tall dude, um. The center for the... the, the Akeem? Nah. The, um, the, Akeem one, the one he had the issues with, the young boy. Well, Howard. Well, well, Howard? Nah, the young... Uh, whatever. But um, the young kid that... um, JaVale like McGee. That. You know how he had to did the whole show Who? on him? JaVale McGee. Oh, McGee. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. I could have did all of Nas's honorable mentions, but I'm not. But I got two. Okay. The verbal intercourse was crazy. Oh, true. On, 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 uh, on Shaq? No. My, no, Nas. Nas. That's on Nas. Verbal Intercourse on the, um, purple, <coughs> on the purple tape. Uh, I can't even quote stuff right now because I'm not in the right thing. And then the New York State of Mind remix, the joint with him and Rakim. Rakim. With yeah. Alicia Keys. Yeah. That when, was hot. When he did the, 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 the uh, Saddam Hussein verse, when he said, um, his, burning his unborn uh, children. Looking like, uh, Watching his children's birth yeah. remains. I don't know if y'all really listen to this track, but at the very last track of ran, the Grind like Date, De La Soul sad. album on the coke crap, the, the, the rock cocaine flow, Doom killed that shit. Oh, I gotta hear that. I didn't hear that one. Uh, yeah. I, I heard about Doom. Doom. Yeah. Doom killed that shit and. This nigga had the Ill, one of the illest, in, like, his intro to hip-hop for us. <coughs> he still did his thing, but he never did it like this to me. But Capadonna on Winter Wars killed him. I never shit. liked Capadonna. I but never liked Winter Capadonna. Wars, that verse, he, he killed him. He killed him? When nah, that nigga said, yo, feel it, that nigga said, yo, I'll split you like a blunt. Reconstruct your whole design, nigga. Like, that's some crazy shit. Like the shit, he he says that hood, like he he says that hood abstract shit. 
I don't like. But oh, after yeah, that, bro. he really didn't that was it. live that. up to yeah, the, to the Winter it. War shit. Don't like Captain Capadonna. As a fan, I'm not a fan, but the Winter Wars, it w we wouldn't know about Capadonna if it wasn't for Winter War. Yeah, yeah, he, he, I see, I can see you on that one. All right, who else you got? That's it? That's uh, for, for okay, now, so, until somebody brings all right, something, so something else. I got, I got you. I got you. Got you. What you got? What you got? For oh, me? no, I have one more. Okay, what you got? I have <clears throat> most death beef. Oh. Oh, beef. Oh. Beef is crazy. Beef. That's oh. what I said. Most nah. death. Beef is Most deaf and, 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 and Tyler Polly on the on the redefinition. See, yeah, Seven and, and, and the, but the thing I did was I was going on quotables and I wasn't going on people's songs like verses. That's yeah. why I said y'all cheating, but right. like that's because that, right. that's ver those are quote stuff. Yeah. So I did. That's why I did what I well, did. Well, you know what? Know what I got stuck in? I was I was listening to the to each song and it was just so many strings. It's too many. I could have yeah. string. Like I could have did of, like all metaphors. Yeah. G -rap. I just couldn't ignore. I could have did all G rap or rock him when it yeah. came to cool yeah. anything. Yeah. Like it was just too many strings of metaphors. Tell the truth. That those, third ver that third verse that third verse of I'm bad is crazy. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. The third verse of I'm bad is Yeah. Composition so what, is done what, what, what are my honorable mentions that I thought was very important to leave not leave him out was um K. Well, we knew that. Paz K, Jeffrey, remember the duet they did? Listen. Jeffrey, Jeffrey, Paz K. Listen. Positively Jeffrey, they call <laughs> Why? Listen, my boy. A good combination to me was. This was after he. he MC Light and Positive K. Huh? No, not that one. Mm -hmm. This His freestyle type joint. Where he did that. Oh, um, he, he has some shit with Yeah, yeah, yeah. I give him um, that. <clears throat> Oh shit! Now you made me lose it. I'm sorry. Um, oh. Oh, see, I don't mean to be for add fuel to the fire. The never said I did, then I'd probably be a liar. It's been seven years and I still haven't retired. If I retire, who would kids have to admire? Now, don't front. Just say that it's true. I'm like the love boat, I'm exciting and new. And now we're gonna do like we did in 82 to the Latin Quarter crew. Y'all know who was who, it goes Shamma Lama, King the Body Slammer. Watch Paz K just grab you with the grandma. I hit your girl how to hand a hammer. She said, Pazzy, why you slammer? She says, he's a bad mamma jamma. Just string after string of like metaphor. Fucking I love, hilarious. I Paz K dope. back in the day. Dope. But we're talking about back then. This dude was yeah. lyrical, man. But, but, yeah, he, I never but take he wasn't Puma. doing nothing but stealing Puma's style. No, he come was, on. He was a generic He had his Puma. own style. But you had, but back but then. But you had Dana Dane doing Slick Ray yeah, You had his own style. But he that's the thing. It was, it was he fresh was and so new. And that's crazy. Okay, can I ask you a question? Go. Just a little bit off the subject. Yeah. But like you said, he's a generic Puma. I, I will not co-sign that, but go. Dana, Dana Dane is a generic I will co-sign that, yeah. When it was real he used to run with Paz K. When it was real when was it was like real Paz heavy K. on <laughs> when we did not accept biting. Right. right. Yes. But we accepted that shit. Yeah, we did. Cause Dana Dane, Dane shit was hot. But, well, we we did, but we didn't know Dana Dane, Dane was biting until years later. Oh, I knew from we the knew show. We knew that. You knew yeah. that. Yeah. That yeah. was so the whole thing. We all oh, knew that. Yeah, but so they, had the, they had the show. Omega oh, the Heartbreaker was doing it. We knew that. Dana Dana that was wasn't it. his accent Slick was the and crew. But we I didn't know that that wasn't the nigga's accent. I didn't know that until like 93 when we signed up together. <laughs> that was the Kango crew right there. Them four. Yeah. So. One of my so, one okay, of my so honorable why? mentions. Why did we accept that? And that and that was the, the, the heart of when we knew what biting was. We accepted it because, I think because they, they didn't take each other's lyrics. I think that's what that that's was. That's what it was. They were, they were so, so You could take a style, but not lyrics. Yeah, the way you, that, it seems like not that's how it worked. It's not I mean? even his style. He took his swag. He took the, the But the, we the knew swag. it did like like Cedric said, it just didn't curl. Because let me tell you something. Yeah. If you heard a Omega the cool, Heartbreaker rap. We was cool with that. Right. If you heard well here's the thing. You know what I'm saying? Everybody in the Kango crew that were rapping did the English accent. But Day to Day stories was dope. They were real dope. Yeah. Said the fella and all that. Yeah, that was the brilliant. Fella. Yeah. You know, that was brilliant. I mean, y'all heard the Street. Yeah, the Lancet Street. Street. Yeah, Delancey Delancey Street. 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 Street was a good one. If you, <laughs> if you, if listen, if you, if you listen to Street. the lyrics of Nightmare, that's, that's, I know the whole story. Yeah. Bro, yeah. this was all in the playlist that got sacrificed <laughs> I today. Know, I'm sorry. I know. I listened to it all. If you listen to the, it's it's a story and it's genius. 
And to hear that he didn't write it all together, that that even makes yeah, sense. Yeah, that's crazy. That like the makes, way he wrote his joints. Yes, that, that, that even makes yeah, even he, better. Yeah, yeah, he put pieces and pieces together. Yeah, yeah that's genius. Yeah. And it's still, man. My honorable mention, and I want to say it before Like the ASPCA, I had to take the dog in. I want yeah. to say this before. What? This takes my genius. honorable mention from me. Go. My honorable mention, and I know y'all don't know nothing about this, <laughs> but the, the song. Every single lyric on the, every single bar on that song makes sense, and every single bar on this song I'm about to tell you is fire. Whoa, this is a flawless song. Okay. No More Pain by Tupac Shakur. I'm not a Pac fan. No, no, I don't. You don't have to be a Pac fan. I gotta get out of my house. So I, I'm just saying, I, <laughs> I, get the fuck out. I haven't heard it, so I don't know. Out of my face. Song. <laughs> Yo, no more pain. No. I don't know the song. I couldn't tell you. No what more, album is it on? No more pain. Is that you a, know? You know? Is that nigga, apocalypse now? No, you know, nigga slapping Devontae's wing. <laughs> he made the beat. It's crazy. It's crazy. I gotta the nigga to said, "I fully eradicate my vows." Um, lyric something explode on contact. Gaming you hoes. The um, my mother's only blood. Tell the bitches I'm not the one. Say my name, watch bitches come. Yo, the shit is crazy. He said, the, the, the lyrics, I never was a pop fan at all. What made me start listening to pop was um, Hit Em Up. And I listened to Hit Em Up. Oh, Hit Em Up. Like, Jeez, what's yeah. Hit Em Up? Is Hit Em Up on what's First of all, fuck your um, bitch in the click you claim. Uh, West Side, West Side we ride, right, come equip the game. I don't get it. What am I missing? What am I missing? What am I missing? Like what am I missing? Not a I Machiavelli like album. A great Machiavelli album. was his best That's album. Best I'm saying, what am I missing out of that? What you're missing? Because I listened to it, I'm like, yeah, it was it's a, a shit talk. It, right, it didn't. It, I know I was he, never. He, but, I put but, him in the. I put him in the you category. Know of, do you know none of Tupac's songs make sense? I used to love y'all. Did you okay. know that? I gotta start that's what I took from it, but I, that's what I took from it. But I didn't. I thought I was just. The niggas from New York. Stop. Stop. He's just, just a transplant. He's a transplant. Yeah, niggas can't be hating on my boy in my house. Oh, man. You like yeah, man. That's yo, my nigga, yo. I yo. fuck with Pop before I fuck with Biggie. No, I like what hey, Pop stood for. Is there a way for him to hook up the phone? You gotta hear. I like what Pop no stood for. Pain. I like what Pop's You got it. No more pain is Tupac Shakur. Well, we can't. Crazy. We can't. We can't play. We can't play. We can't play. Yeah, recording. We'll, 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 we'll be in YouTube, please. I don't know about that. Anyway, Yo, no more pain is Tupac's greatest. Every single I, bar I, I, on I, that I know, album. I remember. I, I remember well, that. Every single bar on that album is a banger. Like from beginning on the whole to album. No, I, no. On oh, that song. No more pain on that song. Every single bar is a banger. Like the way he rides the beat is ridiculous. See me, I judge the MC how good he rides a beat. If you were offbeat rapper, then that's your thing. Yeah. But when I want to hear like you, but MC, I want to like Ghostface. I want to hear yeah, you yeah. flow. Yeah, yeah. I want to hear <laughs> you flow. When I listen to the music, I want to feel the music, and your lyrics are subliminal because they blend so good with the music. So I find myself bopping to the beat, but right. your lyrics. I'm reciting your lyrics because they fit so yeah, I flawlessly. See, I see what you're saying. Mm -hmm. I can see what you're talking yeah. about. Like, yeah, yeah, they yeah, fit yeah. so and, flawlessly and, and, that I don't even realize right. that right. I just committed your lyrics right. to memory. But that's the R. Rock yeah. nobody does that. Yeah, yeah, nobody nobody He's like, like an instrument. Yeah, yeah, you're right. Yes, yes. He's a part of the, yes. the beat also. Yes. I so think he was the, he the first to do that. He was the first to do that. track. Yeah. Yes. It's tone everything. It's all, yes. You could build around him on, if you just take the track of just his vocals, you can yes. build around that. Yes. You can produce around that. Yes, absolutely. All right, let me get, let me get my last two and I'm done. All right, so, Rebel Without a Pause, Public Enemy. Okay. Mm -hmm. If you listen to every line, it's a, it's purposeful. Yes, the rhythm of the Rebel yeah. Without a Pause, a more <coughs> Rebel. Yeah. The hard rhymer, where you never been on in. You want styling, you know it's time to get deep. The enemy telling you to hear it. They play the music, it's time they play the lyrics. Some say no to the album, the show, Bum Rush of Sound. Some I made a year, year ago. ago. Okay, so he's telling you an entire story. Mm -hmm. He's telling you what his purpose is here. He's telling you, yes, I know that you, the distracting beats and all that shit, I know that's what you really want. That's my gimmick, I got you. But now that you've heard my song a hundred times, you're learning my words. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So he's telling you that he's consciously, he's conscious of what his, the impact of his music is, and he did it for a reason. 
Right. Mm-hmm. Genius. Yeah. Fucking genius. Mm-hmm. Chuck funny though. You know what's funny about Chuck? Please tell me. Because Chuck, right? If you listen, if you know Chuck Paz, right? And I know you do. Yes. I'm pretty sure we all do. But Chuck was that dude that used to like to go to the parties and dance. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes. And that's <coughs> why he started rapping. Yes. Because he was tired of the motherfuckers getting on the mic saying shit. Yes. Yeah. But if you think about it, he that nigga that got on the mic so you stopped dancing. Yes. And sit there to think about what the fuck you yes. say. Yes. Yes. Say, the fuck what you say? doing, you hypocrite yeah, ass yeah, nigga? Yeah, yeah. But yes. what the fuck you say? <clears throat> so Chuck Chuck is one of the fir- uh, one of the few MCs I feel you like know what? play Chuck without no music. You know what, motherfucker? Just listen Chuck to Chuck. Listen you can do that. And yeah. you'll be like, yeah. then you can appreciate <clears throat> I'm going to say this right there. Like, like right a rock hip. The like shit they talking about, you motherfuck. Motherfuck Chuck D. No, oh! You, crazy. you can't say right. fuck Chuck D. Yeah, now. Chuck D, listen. No, Chuck, Chuck, okay, I'm okay, sorry, Chuck. Okay, no, no, no. Since he no, said that. No, since he said that. Chuck D no, no, was no, not the voice of P.E. No, Professor no, 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 Griff, I'm listen, riding with no, you. No, listen. Griff was behind all that. No, Chuck no, D no, was no. just a no, front No, 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 man. listen. Okay, since, since, could we get Chuck a little... Chuck D was the front man. He had the voice. Could we get a Chris little real in here then? Let's get real. Go. That's what we're here for. Okay, let's get real then, because I love both of them. Let's go to my last one. I'm going to go to my last one. Let's get real. No, go to your last, because you disrespect me. I'm still number one. Who? He was still taking rap that's video. A, that's that's, that's my video. favorite yeah. song. I love that song. Yes. I'm still number of one. Of all time? Yes, yes. That's my that favorite song. song of all time. I listen to it weekly, sometimes daily. I love that song. You can't go wrong with from, that. From, from the beginning to the end, 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 I yeah. love that you song. You can't go wrong and with that. And that's a perfect segue, because this was... I, I even just like the numero uno remix. I just wanted to start... Ooh. I just wanted to start some shit. Ooh. I just wanted you to know. start some shit. Start some Since shit. Since you dissing my man Chuck like that. Chuck some was shit. it. Straight up. Chuck like, was it. Okay, we got four, Chuck right? was it. Chuck He's literally... It may go... It may be a tie since we got four here. That was all great. I don't believe that, but go. Griff was the heart and soul of P.E. Okay, strip lyrics. I mean, strip... Strip, the music? strip music. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Who wrote them songs? Chuck did write Chuck, them songs. Chuck. Chuck and Chris. Chuck didn't write them songs. Chuck and Chris. Chuck didn't write them songs. Chuck and Chris. Without music. Without music. I love both of them. But you yeah. you just, you ain't have to diss Chuck like that. Nah, oh, that was uncalled for, sir. What the fuck? Just because Chuck ain't got all that. Motherfucker, give me a down <laughs> Just because Chuck. <laughs> wow. <laughs> just because wow. Chuck don't ride beats like everybody. Chuck got shit to say. Chuck, Chuck got shit to say, but so did, so did, what's that nigga? Uh, I am King not co-signing son. this. So did King not Son, like oh, Father MC. You, you know, know what we say F King Son then. I'm not that. a King Son fan, but I'm just saying. You had. I couldn't fuck with that nigga too much. King Son oh, ain't Chuck. King Son had yeah, something to say. And he's no Chuck D. Raheem had something to say. All them, was it, like Kim Shabazz had something to say. But listen, could you agree that sometimes. The Grand Verbalizer had But could you. But could Brother J, would you okay. say? Could we agree that sometimes? About it, rocking, but could we agree that, that sometimes we need that simplicity to? We need the I simplicity. Yeah. I we need that. the simplicity. But I, I yeah, recently now you see who's the real and who ain't yeah. the real. Yeah. But yeah, I yeah. recently yeah, watched definitely. the interview on YouTube where Chuck D was up there and he was. It was an old interview, very old, when they first kicked. Um, Griff out the group. Okay, I understand. Okay. I, I knew you going there too. But listen, let's don't go there. Griff, let's just Griff talk about group. lyrics. You don't get to be a rebel with a, without a pause and be all it is. But I could, and even because I watched the follow up. At the end of the day, though, said, I realized no, if that if you all this, if you all this militant, and but you Chuck is an artist. Thing, at the end of the day, Chuck's an artist. So if you. See, Chuck's I, that nigga, but he's not that nigga. If you really that's what listen to what. Chuck ain't that nigga like Chris is that nigga. Hold up, Chris, Chris is Yeah, no, yeah. You know, I agree right? that. Yeah. Hold yeah. up, let me ask you something. Yes. Yes. Do we agree? I agree with that. Because, Chuck, because Chuck had more go for Chuck was it's on death chair. Hold up, let me ask you this. That's, Chuck, that's what made him. Yeah, me, Chuck was yeah. on death chair, so he had him. to be political yeah. okay, correct let me ask you or this. being what he was. Let me ask you this. If Malcolm X came and said, okay, by any means necessary, let's do all this and do that, and he got everybody to rally behind him, Malcolm X. And we walking down to say, Brother Johnson, because we ain't going nowhere till we find out the nigga got medical attention. Yeah. We marching down the street. And as soon as the cop go up to Malcolm and say, listen, you got dispersed, bro. Or we going to put a bullet in you. And Malcolm say, well, we ain't going nowhere without seeing Brother Johnson. 
yo, I, I, I'm run down here and I'm go to the bathroom. And he don't come back and leave everybody sitting in the street. That's what the fuck Chuck D did to Griff. No, also, Because Griff was uh, riding with I understand him. What but you as soon as they said, yo, you better act right and we gonna get you yeah. locked up. He said, well, yo, Griff. This is what they talking that about, was, but I, Public I, Enemy is a such yo, a... Yo, from, from that point no, on... Public Enemy public is enemy. such a touchy situation. It is. Public the Enemy group. as a machine. It, yeah. So I, don't follow him as, as a political a leader. Bro, you... I don't, you I follow, we talking about lyrics. We're I, talking I, about lyrics. Lyrics. We're not, yeah. Okay, we talking about lyrics. Lyrics. Because I'm... I, you already know how I do. I already talking, know that. I'm talking about lyrics too, but Chuck ain't that just, dude. Hold up, hold up. It's just like... We know that. Yeah, we know Your boy, Jeffrey Atkins. See, When 50 Cent... When 50 Cent ended Jeffrey's career. Yeah. And he, told exposed, you, yeah he definitely did that. And exposed Jeffrey for the, the bitch nigga that he No, is. he didn't expose him. What what 50 did well, was expose 50, himself. 50 smacked him. Because all but 50 listen, did you was don't get the, talk you don't shit get about his style. And, and then took it. Took it. And, exactly. and took it. And took it. And ran with it. And look at him. He make it. And, yeah, and, 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 ran your, your, and one of your favorite shows. Now look at him. You love power. He's, he's, he's the white boy's this, poster boy. That that fifty that we've seen is not the same. That's 50 not the same fifty from the mixtapes. Oh not, no, it's not the hungry that, fifty. That's not no, that fifty not the, that was fucking with. No, I'm, I'm not talking about. I'm not talking about. I'm not talking about. Fifty worse than Chuck. The but this shit, there, there comes a time. Listen, there comes a time when. Yes. There comes a time when you step in the scene. Okay, let me ask you this, and this is blasphemous, and please forgive me because I don't mean this, and I wish there was a way that I could make up for what I'm about to say, but I I like filter, and you know my mother used to tell me that. We ain't get into that. Listen, if I said Rock Kim Allah speaking all this shit, guards and shit, but then Rock Kim Allah, he come out and he sucking dick. How you feel about Rock Kim? How you feel about everything Rock Kim said after that? Oh you, how would you feel about everything Rock Kim said about that? I'm about to do a, that? I gotta do a tip on that one. Yeah, I'm gonna finish this shit. I'm sorry, Rock. I'm sorry, bro, I didn't mean it. I was using you example. But no, it was I, yeah. I don't even know why would you go there. I know. I'm. I'm no, because I'm, you're I'm, acting like Chuck D. Somebody motherfucking image. No, I'm listen. Hurt. No, see. I Chuck understand D, what you're Chuck saying D about don't get no yo, respect. Yo, Chuck, Chuck is the reason. Listen, the real reason why Public Enemy broke up was because of Chuck. Because of Chuck. Because Chuck's a homo nigga. No. No. Because, no come he, on. <laughs> but <laughs> see, you got dirty, but he's listen. I understand what you're saying. Yo, but I, I, hope just don't, I hope this don't take nothing to do that. But, but Chuck is a homo nigga. Oh, no, come on. Uh, him and Eric Sermon. When I see, see you, Chuck, Eric Sermon. Please stop <laughs> threatening listen, people. Listen, I understand what you're saying. But <laughs> look, look at it like this. <laughs> look, look at it like this. Now, look. Who's Chuck down with? Def Jim. Def Jim. Yes. Who's Chris down with? Um, Jive. Jive. You got a lot to lose. You're down with the Motown of hip hop. Yes. Okay. You have. Yeah, now, you okay, now look. Okay, where, so, where, where so we you at gonna here? sell your soul. Where we at? No, no, how no, many MCs? How many MCs? Chuck's up here. Yeah, Chuck's Chuck 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 down here. Listen, Chuck's believe that. Chuck's dealing with Jews, baby. Listen, so why sell your soul? How many MCs talk about not selling your soul? Think about the machine. The machine. Think about the machine. Leroy Cohen and them. You deal. Right. Yo, Kevin Lyle. Think about the machine. Am I going to? Am I going to continue to sell? And still put my message out there, right? Under supervision. Like, well, you already know that we all. Listen, can or, okay, can I put am, I gonna, to am I going to get buried in hip hop graveyard? Yeah. When I, and you can still Listen, make it. Can I, can I, can I, can I, still can I, 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 at the time, Chuck D was the hottest thing on the planet. Public Enemy was the hottest thing on the planet at the fall of Griff, right? Okay. When Griff said what he said, they was the hottest thing on the okay. planet. Okay. Everybody yeah. loved him. So therefore, when you're at the height okay. of your career Question. like that, does it really matter if you're on Def Jam? Because you the hottest ticket. Yeah. Yes, so it does. I mean, because listen, okay. I'm the hottest now, listen, on listen, the planet listen. right now. I could go anywhere and get Def okay. Jam money. True. No, 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 no,
Yeah, it's channels. Okay. It's definitely channels. Mm-hmm. A giant company like Def Jam My who has a stable lucky. Who has a stable <laughs> of artists. Mm-hmm. Some of the biggest in the industry. Right? Because think about their stable at that time. Mm-hmm. They had a huge stable of incredible artists. They were, the, they were them. Right? Think about this. Like you said, the Motown. A Chuck D. Yeah. A Chuck D and a public enemy goes against the grain. Now, they're already giving them some freedom. But if they go against the grain completely, they get frozen out. Not just by Def Jam. By everybody. Warner, yeah. Electric, and <coughs> yeah. Oh, no, but do you... Want to take that chance? Because listen, a Jive RCA, okay, a Jive RCA is just Jive RCA. So basically, you're telling me you but would sell your soul. RCA, you would sell your soul to keep the right. So, so basically, you're you saying jive, you would sell you soul, you your soul to, to keep the record. Wiped out. Right? Because RCA, you can get wiped out. Because RCA is okay. not so a Warner Electric. So the general Atlanta. consensus is, is the general consensus is is you three people. No, no, no. Would sell no, your soul. No, four. Not me. I'm not you included. Just, listen, I would not. You just mentioned that. You, I would say that you would sell your somebody. soul. Okay, go ahead. I said that you would sell your soul against Griff, the heart of the group. Because without the S1Ws, they declined. They they, they went down. Without Griff, because Public Enemy, regardless if you want to admit it, was Flavor Flav, Chuck D, a group. Terminator X, and Professor yeah, it was the whole Public group. Enemy machine has to <coughs> okay. move on. But do you so sell your soul for one of the group? It's not about selling your soul. No. And I, listen. It's not selling your soul. I, that listen, was selling listen, your soul to the, me. You yeah, sell yeah, Your question is pretty much answered. If we came in this door, if all three of us right now, yeah. we came in this door together, yeah. all right? right? We're a group. Yeah. Like Wu-Tang, like... NWA, whoever, yep. we walked in this piece together, mm-hmm. and this was our plan. Mm-hmm. We sat in this basement right here, and we said, this is what we're going to do, and we going in there together, all for one, one for all, blase, blase. Then we get in the door, and any one of us, somebody at a record company, or somebody who don't appreciate me, probably, it's probably going to be me, because I ain't got the fill up. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> whoever's in the record company or whatever, say, you know what, the nigga J.D., he he don't know how to bite his tongue, and we need him to bite his tongue, and he just not biting his tongue. So if y'all want to make this money, y'all got to get rid of him. Mm-hmm. Even if we sat here and playing together, I'm not built like that, bro, because I'm be like, yo, fuck it, and we, we all got to leave. No, we're going to have a conversation. If, if yeah. it's me personally, we're going to we gonna sit down as a group of four. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, Look, this, this shit y'all did said. to Bobby Brown was wrong. I was just about to bring that up. <laughs> nah, what they did to Bobby Brown was right. Wow. But Bobby, Bobby <laughs> fucked himself up. Not, well, the thing yeah, Bobby is, fucked himself up. Bobby fucked himself up. We're thinking Bobby started the group, gonna, but we're not going to get use, into that. I'm going to use your Wu-Tang reference here. Look at all the members of Wu-Tang. <clears throat> Individually. You got about, weak niggas like Golden Arms. Yeah, you got to think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to be realistic. And, about, all right. Like, if we got guys, four here. You some, guys, if you yeah. got four... Look at the history of this, and I'm yes. going to cut you off. No, no. How many groups where all every member is is a solo is Ill. Ill. Every member every is member is Ill. Ill, and so and was Some, able. So, let me we, tell you, we'll, somebody, we'll about, somebody along for the ride. Thank you. Think about Wu Tang. <laughs> somebody along Wu-Tang. just for the ride. I don't know. I'm lucky think, to be here. Think, think, think about think about Wu Tang. This wasn't along for the ride. Think Griff was the hardest. Think about Wu Tang. Yeah, but think about Wu Tang. Yeah, you're right. Out of Wu Tang. Who was, let's be honest. Capadonna, you was God. Really, who was really successful? Meth. 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 Dirty. Dirty. RZA, because of his production. RZA. Yeah. And, and, and Rayquan. And Rayquan. Rayquan was in order. But, I mean, listen, we talking about success I amongst give, us. I got Ghost, Rayquan got lucky because he still had a classic album. But it was, and there's, yeah. there wasn't for that and there's more, yeah. and there's more. Rayquan also does the endless fucking features. Yeah, feature. Yeah, you put him on something. He was on yeah. hot shit. So yeah, at yeah. that time, you gotta, you gotta, he was you gotta, on like mob deep shit yes. at that time. You gotta with, give him Nas and you gotta give him his due. But yeah. even now, because he's even, even, even if he hasn't put together so, a complete yeah. body of work like a full catalog worth, you think of all of his features and he's yeah. bodied every fucking feature. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So we got to give him his respect and his due. Yeah. Ghostface, Ghostface right. is another one. Ghostface is holding Ghostface down is another one to keep the right the the legend. Yes. Ghostface is another one. Right. He, the lights so, yeah. so we think about those artists, 
And I hate to do Jizzer wrong. Jizzer wasn't all that great. No. Back in the what? day, remember? Listen, no, okay. see, he's a Jizzer fan. You know what? I went to I his, like his, I went to his no, house no, in like no, 93, I like 94. I like Jizzer. Like Jizzer. And he had a genius tape. I'm not arguing. I know where y'all coming from. That was some terrible shit, though. Jizzer's the word from the genius. I still got the tape. Okay, Jizzer's that dude. If we got four, if we got four, if we a group, you the DJ, we definitely need you. Yeah. You the ill MC, you the top MC, right? You the I'm Sheik Looch. <laughs> nah, <laughs> I like Sheik Looch. We, we had a discussion on that way. Yo, okay, you the DJ, but you the you. Yo, uh, shit. Everybody loves our production because you the producer. I'm the. I'm Jerobi. I'm the second. Jerobi, I'm yeah. the second yeah. MC. I'm the lower yeah. tier. Jerobi okay. was down with Tribe Called Quest, huh? I'm yeah. the lower tier. Yeah. Right. 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 No, he's still there. He's the same. I'm the lower tier MC. Nah, right. Right. Let's just say Jerobi don't do nothing. Don't nobody know who Jerobi is. Did you hear him on the new album? Nah, he ain't listen. He don't, he don't listen to none of that shit. I don't listen to oh, Quest no more. But listen. But listen, I'm the lower tier MC. Y'all really don't, don't need me. I don't listen to Quest no more. And, but on the strength we family, And on the strength of that, I may be your cousin. Right, I mean, yeah. Like I'm saying, on the strength we family, I, I keep you around. I mean, like yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we but, want the, you to eat. but the thing we about that. No, okay, the thing about this. You got lyrics. You probably a daylight fan too, huh? He's stupid. He's stupid. But he's stupid. Because <laughs> 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 he, he swear by posse news. He's stupid. He, he's stupid. What? He's stupid. You don't like posse? You don't like posse? <laughs> and he don't listen. Yo, I used to like, I used to like your company. Boy, yeah. I used to like, yeah. I used to listen, like your company. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, but listen, the thing about it is, I understand. No, I understand. It's production no. by itself. No, I understand. No, listen. we talking about lyrics. But lyric? No, he don't understand because he's a like beat Bob. guy. He likes beats. I like beats. He don't really see the only. I thing, like beats and I like lyrics, but I don't like you like old tell. lyrics. I, no, I, I don't. You don't like, give nobody new chance because it's all about beats. Wait, wait, listen, Pasta News is the lyricist. He is. Okay. I mean, I like Pasta News back then. Pasta News, I always said Pasta News and Q-Tip should have changed names. Yes. I agree with that. They should have changed. Because he's the abstract. Yes, I agree with that. He should have changed. What? I mean, I like Pasta News from back in the Daisy Paragraph. Oatmeal President. Just rookies to me. Come on, son. I like their first album. But I wasn't impressed. That's the coolest album. That was the wackest one. That was the wackest one. That was the wackest one. That was the coolest album. Steaks Yo, high you know how long it took me to get into potholes in my lawn? Yeah, I, I like it now. Exactly. Because I, I appreciate it, it they now. Lost, so they lost the first album with like 88 tracks on it. They lost so is that. When I they first heard that, I said, yo, these niggas is on some new shit now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oohs yeah. and noodles or oohs no, and oohs. Yeah. 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 Are you kidding me? See, I'm a creature. I'm a creature of habit. I can't. I don't like change. That's your problem. If this will yeah, yeah, you gotta learn how to adapt. Yeah. I don't, you I don't like Jane. You gotta learn how to adapt. You gotta like Jane. No, I don't like Jane. Like if 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 Rakim came up sounding different, I wouldn't fuck with him no more. I don't like Jane. One of the I'm illest saying. beats of your beat, man. Pasta News did the love song by the Bush Babies. That beat was fucking fire. He ain't hear that. I never beat. heard the Bush Babies. You ain't never heard of the Bush Babies? I know who they are. Yeah, I right. never listen. Yeah, I never most most def, def, the most definitely def singing the hook. Yeah, I ain't never give him no run. Get down, come everybody. You didn't hear that? No. Move he ain't fuck with Tom Lil Quality. I just started fucking with Camp Low. Oh now, my God. Just and, now? And now that I found out the nigga homo, I'm good on him, kind of. We gotta keep this nigga out the basement. <laughs> we gotta keep this nigga out the basement. I didn't mean. No, I'm sorry. No, I didn't, no, no, I didn't, I didn't you know. know. Other stuff coming out right now. Yeah. Okay. Oh my no, God. Listen, listen. Yeah, ain't a nigga on my wall too, man. Yeah. yeah, yeah Hold up, listen, listen, listen. Yeah, I got a racist nigga on the wall. Oh man, y'all gonna play on my name? Oh man, listen, listen. Oh, yeah, oh, man. Y'all gonna play on my name? It's like you walked out the house with something. Like you supposed to? Like yo, Adam, yo, you you seen something? Nah, damn, my bad. I'm sorry. Yo, nah, nah, nah. Let me, let me, let me, let me reco. Let me correct this. Back in the day when Camp Lo first came Chuck. out with you gotta Luchini. Go back to Chuck. You yes, fucked up with when Chuck. When they first came out with Lucini and all of it, the Cooley High album. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that was I, fire. I was feeling them then. Yeah. But after that album, there was so much music coming out at that time. But they fell under the radar, too, though. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, they fell no, under but the radar. They, they but, still... but this is, let me explain. Go ahead, go ahead. Like I'm saying, it's not that I don't like fuck with De La. It's not that I didn't fuck with Camp Lo. It's not that I didn't fuck with, what you call it, with Tribe Called Quest. That's old I love the Jungle Brothers. But but you don't fuck but, with too much um, Native Tongue shit. Yeah, I fuck. I used to fuck with them. But yeah. see, at the time when they came out, when they first did their debut, debut albums like the Cooley High and um, Three Feet High and Rising Black and 
you know, plows in my lawn and all that shit. And right, right. When they first came out, I fucked with them. That's their first album. But then they so much... better. But Way no, better. But, but this is what I'm saying. So much music was coming out at that time that, okay, you like this nigga right now, but seven other groups just came out. So, back then, I was running the streets. I didn't have time to keep fucking with Daylight waiting for their next shit to come out because eight other niggas that came out who I'm feeling. So they kind of fall by the wayside for six or seven I years. Mean, I don't focus. It's no, bad. no. It's not that I like dick dedication. But listen. See, dick listen. dedication is when back in the day you'd be like, yo, you want that nigga dick because he, he lyrical. So he like dick dedication. No, nah, that's you got to. That, that, that's what that, they that, are. Yeah. Listen. As a lyricist, we're because I'm a as a lyricist, man, I'm a purist. you and are what you are. I'm a purist. Once but you put, what, what's once happening you is claim, like, you never is gonna be whack. Okay, well the truth of the matter is, a lot of the time. Why are you trying to get the people down with you? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you trying to get the people <laughs> down with you? Room. No, because y'all niggas trying to gang up on me. They trying to gang up on me. We gang up on you. They trying to jump me right now. They trying to jump me. Yeah, you can't disrespect Chuck. I'm not a big public enemy fan. But you disrespect Chuck. I can't let Chuck get disrespected. Fuck him and Elvis. Listen, <laughs> the truth of the matter is this. Shit was coming out, right? Okay. During that time. Yeah. And during that time, I was in the streets. So I was hearing shit like in the cars and all that kind of stuff. Then I stepped away and I did a bit. So then well, while I was doing that little bit, people was coming out with shit. You forgot what so reality when I, was bringing when, us, though. When I, yeah, y'all y'all knew about it. Yeah. So when I came out, that shit was but, all, uh, but yeah, uncharted. That, that's that all was uncharted all uncharted. Yeah. So that, like, was old, so that was old school to you. Like, you missed out on something I, they brought up. Okay, example. Go to jail doing Three Feet High and Rising, mm -hmm. and you come out, you and did. they done did six or seven other albums. Yeah, you didn't listen but to now the shit you, was dead and all that shit. But now you the think. shit you hearing on the radio, because when you're locked up, all you're hearing is the radio. That's all you got, radio. Right, yeah. the radio. So Not that radio, I don't know anything about being locked up or anything, but I heard. <laughs> Okay, on the I radio, on the radio, they didn't play. They didn't play none of Daylight La Soul is Dead. They didn't play those eight yeah, songs, they did. them yeah, eight yeah. albums. They're playing Jay Z now. Yeah. So I went from Daylight La Soul to this is hypothetical. I, get you. I, get I went you. from Daylight La Soul to Jay Z. So now, a couple years passed. Now I might hear. Yeah, uh, I get you. I get dead it. now. I, I get it. I'm eight years late for I that. And now it. I'm saying, oh shit, that's kind of death. And I'm bringing it to somebody, and they like, yo. Yeah. And you know, what the fuck is that? Right. Just, on, just on the stuff you said that, we're going to keep you, we're going to keep the name up there. Right. Just, we're yeah. going to keep you, and you can come back. Oh, you know, you can yeah, come you're back not going to pay no more. No, no, we're going to pay no more the name now. Okay, can we darken my shit in, though? Just cause? Yeah, can we use, like, can we use, like, Sharpie? Some silver and shit? No, some Sharpie, that shit that comes through paint. So when you decide to pay no more, they still come back. I get it, so listen. I get you. He didn't have the luxury to. I get you. So I just have a question for you. So at no point did you ever feel curious enough? Back and just try to no, catch up. I, no, I do. I do now. Tell them I got oh, I got nothing but old school, but no, shit that no, I'm no, listening. No, no, no. I'm not gonna sit here and nope, I'm not <laughs> hold up. I'm not gonna co-sign that shit. Hold because up. you be dissing you be like that backpack rap shit, fuck them Q tipping. Oh! Oh no, no, I got <laughs> I play vibrant three twice on. Like, You're a vibrant thing, a vibrant vibrant thing. Shit, that's my sellout shit for Kit. I like that. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, that's a sellout. I like that Tip album. No, no, but see, that's a sellout. So but see, he had to get some numbers. So, so listen, no, but see, he had to get some let me get the times right though. But you wasn't around because I had the luxury, and people don't understand this that thirty six chambers. And Midnight Marauders came oh, out on the same, same day. day. I like yeah. Midnight Marauders. Yes. I like Midnight Marauders, but there was shit that came after that, the like night. that I never heard of, like until years later. And then when I got up on it, because so okay, then the Mob Deeps and all let, that started No, no, in let, let's put it like on. this. Okay, you got let's say Midnight Marauders come out. I hear that. Now they got four other albums here, right? They sure got, it's going off the rails, folks. But bear with us. I'm sorry. Stay just with one, us, second, stay with one second. One second. They got four other joints that came out that y'all done already talked about. But now when I come out, Jay-Z the hottest shit. So I got to do my Jay-Z's. And then by the time I swing around to their last shit, I'm here now with it. And y'all somewhere else with it. 
You understand what I'm saying? Like I, I understand you lost a period of time. I lost a period of time, and then as I'm trying to catch up, new shit is coming out. I got you. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. So it's like, okay, I want to <coughs> listen to this. But and that I new wanna, shit still ain't as good as I, that shit. I never heard of Bush. I, I know who the Bush Babies is, but I couldn't. If you played the Bush Baby shit and not told me, I couldn't tell you. You wouldn't know who it was. I wouldn't know who it was because Bush Babies, I mean, if they was like brand new being, then okay, when I came home, I already, I love like brand new being. So I'm going to look for brand new beer. But shit like YZ, like I got with YZ. Return of the Holy One, Return oh, of the Holy I got that shit in the car. <laughs> yeah. Motherfuckers never heard of that shit. But I only know that song because that was something I listened to back then. I couldn't tell you nothing else about the nigga. I couldn't tell you nothing other than that. Right. PRT, I only know the one album they did with Rock the Funky Joint Shaquille and all that shit. That's, only, that's all yeah. you got, though. That's all they had. That's yeah. all they had? They got a new joint. See, so. A new one now? Oh, See, so now he's saying. Hey, like, else. Um, what's he, other he got a soul, Yeah, he's, he was, I'm, he's rocking yeah. with some other dude. I like, see, he just said. Oh, yeah, he just said, yeah, why, yeah, why his intellect got a new song coming out? That just, He just got a song coming out. Yeah. If he wouldn't have said. If he wouldn't have said that just now, uh -huh. I would have never he, knew he, that he, shit for the next thing. And that's not just you. A lot of people. So a lot of them shits like the Bush Babies and a lot of them niggas that came out, right. if don't nobody mention them to me, I just happen up on them on YouTube and then I'm like, oh, I just heard this joint. Yeah, right. yeah. Listen to it. Like, and then like, niggas is like, that's your that. old. Because if you don't mention the shit to me. That you know, album with Ed O.G. and Master Ace. Am I good again? Y'all like to hear? You good, you good. Can I with y'all? You come back down. You come back down. Master Ace and Ed O.G. That album? Fire. That's just crazy. Fire. Yeah, he put me up on that not too long ago. Fire. I didn't even hear that shit. Little Young. Never been saying that Ed O.G. Little Young. That whole album is crazy. Yes, the whole album is But you know who's, not to cut you off. Yeah. You're going to say Chiali. Yes. That Chiali shit is hot. And I hate Chiali. Chiali lemonade shit. I fucking hate Chiali lemonade. But this new shit. This nigga shit out now. From the time he came home. Fuck with Fat Joe and all this. This is not the Chiali. This nigga right here. He said. He was a lot of shit that If he nigga wrote lyrics for 22 years. If they promote him like they should promote a rapper. But they're not. Yeah, but it's sad. He'll shut a lot of shit down right now. He will shut a lot of shit down. Where the fuck is Grand Poobah at, man? All right. He got a new album. He got an album that came out last year. He came out last year. Yeah, yeah. Yo, that's your album. I don't hear about that. But unless somebody tell you. Yo, that's your album. What about old students live in the same area where his mom lives? I didn't know Rock him lived in Stanford. I didn't know that. Yeah, but right. his, um, his mom Stanford. lives in Bridgeport in the North End, and um, he used to tell me um, about Grand Poobah. And I get all soup, and he'd go back and he'd tell Grand Poobah, I'm a fan and all that. And I was like, oh, yo, I need to come over, you know. Right. I was excited, but Grand Poobah, because I didn't want to be all, you know. Nah, but you, get, you want to be like a dick? You don't want to seem like a dick right No, 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 it's just because of the student. Food. I didn't want to be in the student's area and all that. You didn't yeah, want to that oh, familiarity. Oh, yeah, I feel you. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, that familiarity yeah, outside yeah, of yeah, the school. Yeah, yeah, Because I, I didn't want to do that. Because they'd be like, you're fraternizing with students? And that's just funny. Yeah, yeah. I had, Tell I your stepfather off, to come to school. We got some <laughs> shit to talk about. Matter of fact, I'm going to write you this note saying don't show up without a step parent. But yeah, Grand Poopa, it was, um, lives right next door to his mom, too. Um, um, and I was like, yo, I need to come to the North End. Because I, I always like Poopa. You know? Oh yeah, Puba thorough. Yeah, so you know, if you call yourself a lyricist and don't like Puba, you yeah, something wrong. wrong. Yo, Puba was, was the, I got questions. I'm not even Puba a was the hottest you know, thing I, on I the planet. There was two summers. Puba was the hottest thing on the oh, planet. Oh yeah, hell yeah. Puba was that. Oh hell yeah. Puba's lyrics and dating back to the ultra not ultramatic MCs, Masters of Ceremony. That ceremony, yeah. Puba and I listened to the Masters of Ceremony, um, and. His voice, album. his voice and his style changed between Masters of Ceremony and Brand Nubian. Off the first one, off one. Hey, it, like if no, if he didn't say his name was Grand Puba, you would have known. You wouldn't have known. And then the stuff they did when they did the Foundation album. Mm. The Foundation. He, he evolved yet again. Oh my God, the Foundation was sick. He evolved yet again. Nigga, he got that niggas. What he say? Got that niggas like a cell block going nuts like a. Cell block full of dick beaters. <laughs> yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. Got jack niggas going nuts like a cell Rap block full up, of dick beaters. And there's not a lot of MCs that really do that, that do that evolution. That can evolve from their base and him with um, Master Ceremony all the way to where he, he is. He's evolved so <coughs> much that it's like, damn, you have to recognize him, one, as a pioneer, but two, as a true lyricist. All right? We so saw what that MCs do you Nas. feel? Okay, outside of him. Evolved. Outside of him. Nas. What other MCs have evolved, do you think? Rakim has evolved. Oh, so yeah. Kane, yeah. Not Kane. Not Kane. Kane. What's his name? Um, fucking um, Chris has evolved. Yes. Dramatic. Yes. Dramatically, he's evolved. Yes. Okay. LL. LL. The... LL's questionable to me, and I'm gonna tell you. LL's why. questionable because and he's still the same LL. Well, not not that. Just over the movie. I don't understand how the how evolution does Rakim of LL evolved, but listen, dude, I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. I don't understand that. I don't understand that because Rakim is more <laughs> same like he's on the same. His evolution ended with pink cookies in a plastic bag being crushed by a building. After that part, he was getting he was being ghostwritten. So I can't even give. Who LL? Yep. I can't even give it to him. Don't make me walk up. I can't even give it to him after yeah, we got, that. Because he was, family member he was being ghost written. Yo, how they fire niggas from Fox? That's fucked up. You know how they be firing niggas from Fox? <laughs> 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 we got right now. 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 It go from him to this motherfucker. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Dang. Go, the, we might just take over the show. Like Chuck we and might have to take over Wait, the show. What the fuck is wrong with these Why? niggas? Why? I just got back in. Oh, yeah, you're right. We trying to fire him. Yeah, he didn't ask for fire. Because he's bad about the hell, nigga. Like, you got. You might. Have, feel, you might. You might have to go upstairs with the wife. Yeah. 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 The wife and the kids. I ain't never kicked the family. No, out. listen. This, 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 but okay. If any, could, could we agree on this? If go, anybody go. in the world of hip hop, we could accept have a ghostwriter after a certain amount of years is L. I agree with yeah, that. True. Because L deserve all that shit. Like I don't. And I, think, and I can say I don't this. think. Wait, wait. I can say this. I don't this. think the Drakes and all these. If anybody, that was the first superstar sex wait, 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 all can, that shit. Oh, I can also say this. I can also say this. All this shit. I can also say this about he wasn't completely ghostwritten, and I can respect that. No, no, I'm not trying, trying to, to cover up anything. I can say. I can say. I can say. I can say. I wrote the song with the nigga last week. I can say that his evolution started from the beginning with I Need a Beat all the way, and I can tell you the evolution is clear. I'm going to fuck his head up now. The evolution okay, is say clear. That, I'm going to fuck his head up. Paz Cannon in the He did evolve. No. If you look at the shit he's doing with. Great minds, him and Greg Nice. You can Look listen to the songs. <laughs> See, stop, stop. If you know, you know, you know, fight for that. Listen, if you listen to his, his lyrics now with Great Minds, you can see a clear evolution in his style. Who? Paz K. Well, he has to be out there for us to see it. He is out there. I'm his, saying his, his he songs, the you the Great Minds, the Great Minds album. Wait, wait, I know the Great Minds. I know. I'm not the Great Minds. Not because he's fucking up with L. The Great Mind album is charting. So, charting with. Make it happen is charting. I'm saying, listen, after, after, I'm going back to L. Okay, go ahead. After Mama said knock you out, L could have did whatever. I agree with that. He still kept going. I, I agree with fuck that. I don't care who ghost written for L. I after agree with that. Mama listen, said knock you out. The B, listen, the C, listen. the D, the E, the listen. F, the G, the H, the I, the J, if the K, the at, F. If you look at, if you look at. That's not evolution. If you look at, if you look at that whole album, the number 10 album, right? I don't care about that. He's talking he about that. it gets no rough. Get off, get ready for that 10, man. Let's go back to that album. Walking, Walking with the Panther was his back. worst reviewed album ever. Which one? Walking with the Panther. Yeah. And it was still kind of hot. It just had I, I know, because I like it. That was like the first double album. That was like the first double album without being a double album. I, I liked it. Bit no more quick. All that on that a quick. No, no. no. I had a, the original yeah. jingling baby. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And yeah. 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 that original jingling baby. I'm that type of guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I'm the type of guy to leave my yeah. socks. Yeah. Going yeah. back to Cali with drawers in your hip, huh? Going back to Cali was on that. Was it on that album? No. Going back to Cali was on less than zero. That's on the soundtrack. Yeah, I'll tell you about it. It was on less than zero soundtrack. But they threw it up there. Right, and right, they right. threw Jack the Ripper up there. Yes, yes, yes. They were both yeah. B side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. Okay. Jack the Ripper was L. That was my shit. But um, LL will tell you. L was the just that was gonna be on my list. Was, the he, original he said Jack the Ripper was so he, he just wanted to see himself as a star. He said, "Yo, I did two. Well, there is something albums. that I was gonna use as my honorable mention. Go ahead. Because I because I love I love this particular song. Kumodi. No, I love the particular song. And I love how he dismantled. 
three MCs at once. Oh, to, to the, the break, break of dawn. dawn. Okay. But he did whack niggas, though. I know, but I, listen, that's the only reason I said yo L. No, but at that time, they were. I understand that. At that time, it was like it was like us going to the schoolyard on some elementary shit. No, 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 I know that, but listen, listen. To break a door, he did a three piece. It was dope. It was a three piece. That was a three piece. And on top of that, his content was very visual. Yeah. The shit was hard. It was hard. What is a panther? An animal that kills. I'm like a shark with blood coming out the gills. You could That's never in your wildest dreams get a piece of this gangsta link straight from Queens. Strong, strong as liquor to be seen in a limousine. Scenes. Now you're getting done without Vaseline. What oh bite because your rhymes a puppy child. Made another million so competitors bow. Homeboys, yeah. hold on. My rhymes are so strong. Nothing that was go the best wrong, verse. So why do you go? Come because on. Because it wasn't about then he went into them. Yes. That was the ill. Right, right. Yeah. Now, if you think about, again, we did a three. You killed three. Now, mind you, yes. Lyrically, he could have crushed all three of them, yes. But they were active battles. Yeah, yeah. He bodied oh, three. On, you, bat, you, you, you dishammered. Hammer was huge back then, too. Yeah, that was he it. Was, at but, that time. But, but, he but, he a not a, but he wasn't a lyricist. Yeah, you dissed a nigga with a cartoon. Yeah, a cartoon. Yeah. But, but <laughs> he, as yeah, a lyricist, you, y'all know. You went you down the robber room and started slapping niggas around. You know what I'm saying? As a lyricist, you go to the top people. There's a reason why I thought that that was important. Because... I get it. I know what you're talking about. A one-on-one -on -one battle is one thing. Yeah, when you body three... three but I'm bodying three people. But there wasn't three... It wasn't in like... one Chris, song. If, if he would have bodied Chris, Listen, Rakim, Rock, and Kane... I don't respect that because, that because that's the same thing. Who don't do Listen, that, though? Run DMC was going in the hammer at the time. So Third you're only giving him credit the You're only giving him credit for that because he was the first to do it then. Yeah. I think. He's only giving him credit because no, he was the first. No. Tupac the went after a whole coast by himself. Listen, listen. Hit clever, him up. The cleverest lyrics. I mean, that he, first verse was crazy. The first verse was crazy. But then when he got so, into them, made perm and all yeah, that. Take the, the, the cover and use the, the, the cover as the, the. Yeah, yeah. running back to the bathroom. Yeah. yeah. yeah it was, I wasn't. It was, I the shit about, you know the shit about break it, to break it down, though. The reason why I don't consider it Dude, a diss my record. Old school teacher don't deserve the rap. Come on. That should have fucking made The reason why I never considered it a diss record. It's a catchy, it's a catchy verse. Rap. That's fucking hilarious. Okay. It's a catchy hook. I give I mean, it to you. Like, bar. I give you all that, but the reason why when I think of diss records, that never gets mentioned, not even honorable mention. Because yeah. that wasn't supposed to be the diss record. We can't go into the diss record, Cook. That's going to be another topic. Because yeah, I didn't yeah, even yeah, know. Yeah, we can't, we can't get into that because that's yeah, going to be another episode. That now. That's going to be another episode we're going to run. It was just a nice now. song on the album. Yeah, yeah. It wasn't right. corny. And we gotta I like end this. We got to end this because we got another episode. Yeah, we got another episode. Let's end this when we do another episode. All right, folks. Remember to bang on that like button and subscribe. And please, please, please come back to the next show. All right. As as we are ending the either. hip hop professors. I'm the blacksmith. KJ the architect. Paranormal Adam. And, and fuck Chuck D. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> and we out. And we, we out. out of here.